What are my people? Uh -huh. Another video with the Castro Blues. Let's talk about this. Let's get a little guy right there. Let's talk about this. Y'all will like this. Let's watch, watch this. this. Wow. Dude, I do it. <laughs> it. <Pimp> it. <laughs> <laughs> Future is bright. I mean, this is old. I mean, you probably watched this video before. But we need to talk about something about it. Something about this. This is a, a kid that probably don't learn too much about hitting because he don't got enough in this life, enough in this world. So what, I, what I'm trying to say here is that's a natural swing, kid trying to have fun, but that natural swing is much better than the swing that some people try to make the kids hit and try to get that straight down to the ball, get the knob down to the ball, Hit the ball in the ground. Oh, that swing is better than a lot of... A lot of big leaguers. A lot of big leaguers. <laughs> yeah. A lot, of, <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of high school, college, obviously. A lot of big kids, right? And look at this. Obviously, as a kid, you got things that he can work and get better. But, like, obviously, in that age, he don't going to see nothing but little fastball out there. And the kid need to know the... He can smash the ball in the outfield. When you're in that age, you need to make sure that you keep having fun. Okay? But look at that swing. The most important part in this swing. He stayed Damn, back. What a swing. He stayed back. And now look at the bat pat. That any of you that bat pat is going back and through it. Okay? Look at how he finished. Look at how he get on playing with the ball. You see that? Like that barrel, get behind it and finish up. Just almost like a Ken Griffey Jr. Okay? He don't try to push the ball up. He went right behind it quick and tried to elevate that ball to the outfield like every kid should be doing. Now, the heat trying to push the ball up, the heat trying to get under, I don't know. But it, that swing looks like he get right behind the ball. That swing is a swing that you don't need. You don't need to be changing it. No, and that's it's the a problem. Good swing. You look at those kids that sometimes they're so good when they're little. Now I don't know where they find this coach that he played for ten years in the pro, and they say, "Ah, oh, he gonna get under. That's a upper cup swing. That's not good, dude. Maybe that professional." Don't see the right things. But this kid is know how to get behind the ball and finish natural up. Yes. Okay? That's so, the sad thing about this. No, imagine this a, kid. A lot of bad coaches. There is a lot of bad coaches <laughs> around there. Let me say this. There is a lot of terrible coaches. And they will say that's a bad swing. You crazy, bro? Uh, you don't change that. I've been crazy. Look at that. He getting behind the ball. Obviously, you can tweak a little bit when they get older, but you don't want to change too much about the bat pad. The bat pad is really fine and getting right behind it. And a lot of kids losing that in some point when they start getting older just mm -hmm. because they find that professional, ex-professional. That is house, telling them to go down to it. Ex-professional, whatever, the best in high school they used to play, the best in college, and they want to do the same crap they don't, they, they, they probably don't work for them or yeah. they maybe did it and they were not doing it you know it's just about uh the feeling part right so those coaches teaching those hands to the ball and all that it's all bull crap it's gonna make your kid worse at some point and maybe he's not gonna get to the next level because changing pad is gonna affect this, mm -hmm. their, their, their 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 career that kid is even using his back leg and everything just imagine that kid Look at that. Imagine this kid Bam. growing up like with this swing, having muscle. Next Bryce Harper. Next, Next Juan Bryce Soto. Harper. Oh, yes. Oof. But that obviously he needs to work because it's going to be some things that he's going to probably have to fix. Oh, yeah. It's not like, a, yeah, you're going to keep that swing and that's it. No, it's going to be some work. But he got the right, the right energy. Some good similarities about like similarities with the... Professional, to, prof good, to, to good professionals, good to ones, elite, elite professionals. Hitters. Yes. Elite this is the part. Finish and staying back, finish up. And then the best part, keep it going. I do it. Do it. Do it.
Boom! Wow! Flip it! Yeah! Beep it! Bro, they're a little country, a little country kid. They're, they're parents. Hey, all Hey, all <laughs> All right, people. I hope you like this video. I hope you understand it. This is what we're trying to do. We're trying to educate, bring the right information. And I know you probably have a kid like this, and he's swinging right. Make sure they, they know how to drive the ball, because if they don't drive the ball, they're going to get boring, and they're not going to like the game. And if they don't like the game, they're going to give up on you and then the game become boring. So make sure they know how to drive the ball because in some point, you want your kid hits on home runs like the big leaguers because if you don't hit home runs, you're not going to get paid. And that's the reality. Sorry. No matter how big you are, you can still hit it hard and you can still drive some balls out of the field. All right. See you in the next See one. See you in the next one. Subscribe, my people. See you tomorrow. Subscribe, right. subscribe. See you. <laughs>